if you want to know about the persons who are on board Titanic sub, then this video is for you. So hello everyone and welcome back to our YouTube channel. We are talking about all those 5 passengers who were on board. So without any further delay, let's start the video. The US Coast Guard has tragically confirmed the demise of all 5 passengers who were on board the missing Titan submersible. The discovery of debris near the wreckage of the Titanic points to a catastrophic implosion of the vessel, as stated by rail admirer John Moger. The identities of the passengers have been revealed, shedding light on their backgrounds and aspirations. One of the passengers was Stockton Rush, a 61-year-old experienced engineer who served as the chief executive of Ocean Gate, the company responsible for organizing the Titanic voyage. Rush, who founded the company in 2009, had designed experimental aircraft in the past and had worked on various small submersible vessels. OceanGate garnered global attention in 2021 when it began offering the trips to explore the remains of renowned Titanic. Rush defended the business model, highlighting that the ticket price of $250,000 was significantly lower compared to the cost of space travel. In a tragic twist, Rush's wife Wendy Rush is the great-great-grandmother of Isidore and Ida Strauss who perished in the Titanic disaster. Another passenger was Hamish Hardy. A 58-year-old British adventurer and the founder of Action Aviation, a Dubai-based private jet dealership, Harding had accomplished several exploration feats, including multiple visits to the South Pole and a journey into space in 2022 as a part of Blue Origin's fifth human crewed flight. He held three Guinness World Records, including the record of the longest time spent at full ocean depth during a dive to the Mariana Trench. Harding had a strong affinity for extreme adventures and was described as a charismatic individual by his friend David Mearns, a marine scientist and expedition leader. Shahzada Daud, a 48-year-old businessman, was also on board the submersible, accompanied by his 19-year-old son Suleiman Daud. Shahzada hailed from one of the Pakistan's wealthiest families and served as the vice chairman of Engro Corporation, a prominent fertilizer company. He was actively involved in philanthropic endeavors through his family's Daoud Foundation and supported organizations like the SETI Institute, which focuses on the search of extraterrestrial life. Shahzada's family stated that he had a keen interest in exploring diverse natural habitats and had previously spoken at international forums such as the United Nations and Oxford Union. Suleiman, a student at the University of Strathclyde in Glasgow, had just completed his first year at the business school. He was described as an inquisitive individual with a passion for science fiction, literature, learning and playing volleyball. The other passenger, 77-year-old Paul Henry Nergelet, was a former French Navy diver and a renowned figure in the exploration of Titanic, often referred to as Mr. Titanic. Nergelet had spent more time at the wreck site than any other explorer and was a part of first expedition to visit it in 1987, a mere two years after its discovery. As the director of underwater research for a company that owns the right to the Titanic wreck, Nargelet played a crucial role in the recovery of numerous artifacts, including the notable Big Piece, a 20 ton section of the ship's hull. Regarded as the world specialist on the Titanic, Nargelet had planned for an expedition in the coming year to retrieve additional objects from the wreckage. These individuals, with their diverse backgrounds and shared passion for exploration, embarked on the ill-fated mission to delve into the depths of history and uncover more about the legendary Titanic. The loss of their families is absolutely unmeasurable, and the loss of their lives in this tragic incident has left a void in the exploration community and has saddened the families, friends, and colleagues they left. So stay tuned to our channel and we will be updating you more. Until we meet again, thank you.